I have been to some derbies. With most of them in a somewhat more hostile environment than others. Today's derby is not one with a lot of hate. Don't get me wrong, there will be a rivalry, but it probably won't be the same as... It is more about being able to call your club the best of the city. You see, after doing some research, it turns out that both fan bases are not really from the same city. But seriously, Anderlecht have fans in Brussels and outside the city, whereas Union's fan base mostly consists of only locals. Not to mention both incredible rich history. Yes, Union history dictates back to 1904, where they won the title 11 times. After 1935, it got quiet. Like they got relegated and relegated. We all know the success of Anderlecht, and while they are struggling right now, there's no better time than to stand up against a rival in the city. Let's go to the derby. Right guys, and just like that we are in Brussel or Anderlecht. It's getting dark already, I'm now walking with some Anderlecht fans to the stadium. Let's check out the atmosphere there and just enjoy this another match day experience and dog. Just like that, in the middle of the streets, a pub. I love how a pub like that is full with fans just before the match, in the middle of a suburb, like that's real atmosphere, real of the fans. That's the stadium. Lest you say I have seen more beautiful stadiums from the outside. Then some score predictions. On the left is not really looking good in the table of the Jupiler Pro League and Union are second, so it's gonna be a difficult game for them. It's fair to say they are not really the favorite in this game, but with a good home crowd, I can see they maybe win this derby. So I'm gonna go with a 2-1 home win for on the left. Mate, you got a score prediction card. What do you think the score is gonna be? Um, I think it's gonna be a 2-1 to on the left. Oh, the same as me, same as me. Uh, what's going on with on the left? They're not really in the top of the table. Just bad management, I think. Players don't seem to work all that often and our striker isn't scoring at the moment, so... That's a real problem. Yeah, a real problem yeah. <laughs> okay, um, and what's your relationship with Anderlecht? Why is it so special? Why should people all over the world come to Anderlecht? As you can see, everyone's having a drink with, yeah. their, with our friends. Yeah. The atmosphere is always great, even when we're losing, so I, I think it's especially that. Okay, that's really good. I wish you a good match, enjoy it, and Thank you. cheers. That should be a big tie for there. That is impressive. One minute of applause for Pele. Both a minute side of your applause is both beautiful and it's both for the legend of Pele. And that's King of Guys. Standing. That is one, and that is two. Yep, he's going to check for far. Also a red card. It's taking a long time. Nobody's understanding it. Nobody's understanding the situation. The keeper is literally with the defenders. Basically, no one is understanding the decision of the referee.
how everyone is mad. They are very mad. It is now Union dictating the game. They are having a man more, so they should create some chances. Yes guys, and that's the first half, it's nil, nil. To be fair, Uli had so many chances, but they just couldn't convert it, that's why it's nil, nil. Let's go to the second half with passion and a good atmosphere, and hopefully some goals. Tomorrow we go to a new country and a new darkness. Stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys in the next video.